The Women Tech Council is honored to present the 2019 Women Tech Award finalists. Anissa Brown is Chief of Corporate Transformation and the Federal Women's Program Manager for Hill Air Force Base. Anissa envisioned and then established an off-based software innovation center. Her model has become an Air Force standard. She is a mentor to girls interested in STEM careers and educates entrepreneurs how to grow small businesses into sustainable enterprises. She earned a bachelor's degree in electrical engineering from the University of Northern Arizona and is currently pursuing a master's in systems engineering. Anjul Bombri is the vice president of platform engineering at Adobe. She is focused on making Adobe the ultimate big data powerhouse and leads Adobe's 300 strong global engineering team. She joined Adobe after 14 years at IBM, where she was the Vice President of Engineering and spearheaded the company's big data and analytics platform. She is a mentor, works with the Grace Hopper Celebration Organization, and Girls Who Code. Anjul holds a bachelor's degree in electrical engineering from the University of Delhi. Beth Klaman is the chief engineer at Northrop Grumman, working on the $696 million joint strike fighter contract. She leads a team of more than 15 engineers, producing over 40 composite parts for the fighter. Beth's optimization has doubled the manufacturing rate, saving the company $22 million in labor and material costs. Beth volunteers at the STEM Fair, SheTech, Expand Your Horizons, and University of Utah Chapter of Women Engineers. Beth donated a kidney to save her brother's life and says her biggest accomplishment are her two kids. Christy Kent is the Chief Financial Officer for OptConnect. During her 20-year finance career, she has been involved helping tech companies with investment banking, strategic growth, M&A activity, and consulting and leadership. Christy is actively engaged in mentorship and encourages women to challenge themselves and to seek and identify growth opportunities. Christy earned her Bachelor of Business Administration in Finance from the University of Iowa and her MBA from the University of Chicago. In her free time, Christy enjoys hanging out with her husband, two children, and her very lovable dog. Crystal Valentine is the Chief Data Strategy Officer at Eventbrite. She is responsible for analytics, data science, the data engineering teams, and the organization's strategy for leveraging data. Crystal's career spans both industry and academia. While a professor of computer science at Amherst College, more than 50% of every computer science class were female students. She is a contributor to Women in Tech Conversation at the Huffington Post and uses her technical expertise as a big data volunteer for the Susan G. Komen organization. She holds a patent called Extreme Virtual Memory and earned a PhD in computer science from Brown University. Emily Smith is Director of Strategic Partnerships at Divi. She focuses on forging partnerships with technology companies and financial institutions to further the company's mission to spend smarter. Prior to Divi, Emily served as the director of Kiln Lehigh. She is passionate about entrepreneurship and started her first venture at 19. Emily runs Tan Lines, a swimwear company, a blog, Modest Goddess, and is working on a new project called Wonder Things. Emily co-founded the Silicon Slopes Founder Chapter and started a women in venture capital group. Emily is a new homeowner and calls her little white farmhouse a slice of heaven. Aaron Valenti is the founder and CEO of Tinker, a product development agency and venture studio. Aaron has led her global team of 120 employees across their Salt Lake City and Pakistan offices to build mobile apps, SaaS applications, tech-enabled marketplaces, and consumer websites for brands like Facebook, Skullcandy, and Metro PCS. Aaron is a champion for the anti-human trafficking mission and spent time in Uganda with the Global Exchange and Not For Sale programs. She graduated summa cum laude from Georgetown University and her photography has been published in National Geographic. Heather Conlon Katz is Vice President and Senior Engineer at Goldman Sachs, which provides technical provisioning to over 36,000 people worldwide. Heather is a diversity champion for Goldman Sachs Engineering and works with college organizations like Society of Women Engineers and Women in Computer Science. She founded the Salt Lake City Women in Engineering Network, which provides members with technical and soft skill training and programs. Heather graduated magna cum laude from New York Institute of Technology with a BA in Communications. She spends her free time in the outdoors with her husband and their two sons. Carrie Hensing is Vice President of Product and Brand Experience at RisePoint. 
She drives product strategy. She is a seasoned product leader with over 25 years of experience in product marketing, user experience, and design. Prior to RisePoint, she worked at Microsoft, where her big bet investment led to the creation of SharePoint, resulting in over $1 billion in incremental revenue. Carrie and her family made the move to Utah in part to support their daughter's dream to earn a spot on the U.S. ski team, which she achieved. Carrie volunteers as a U.S. Ski and Snowboard Club Program Administrator. Carla Renee is Associate Content Manager at Lucid Press, a web-based publishing app. She is responsible for the brand's voice, style guide, social media, and resource library, and writes and designs ebooks that bring in hundreds of leads per quarter. Prior to Lucid Press, Carla started her career as an SEO specialist for Boostability. Coming from a poor home in Appalachia, Carla was determined to overcome her circumstances and eventually became a Utah Sterling Scholar, received a scholarship to the University of Utah, and became the first college graduate in her family. She recently married the love of her life, Sam, and is looking forward to starting her own family. Katie Boyd is analytic director and engagement lead for Health Catalyst. Katie started in healthcare IT the day she graduated with her health management degree and has since worked on all sides of healthcare data. She is a champion for diversity and inclusion. As a queer woman in technology, Katie works with the Women's Affinity Group and the Queers and Allies Affinity Group to help raise awareness of the challenges faced by those in both groups. Katie strives to be a voice and lead by example to show that expanding diversity is important in every organization. She is an avid runner and loves animals. Christy Rowley is Data Science Principal Consultant at Domo. Christy co-developed Domo's first data science consulting offering and created Domo's data science team. Prior to Domo, Christy worked in academia as a data scientist and organizational behavior consultant for over 20 years. Christy is a participating member of the Utah County Chapter of Silicon Slopes and the Women Tech Council, volunteers as a mentor for SheTech, and regularly teaches at Domo's coding camp for kids. Christy received her PhD from Vanderbilt University, and when she isn't working, she and her son Jackson can be found exploring opportunities and adventures together. Laura Butler is Senior Vice President of People and Culture at Workfront. She is responsible for creating and reinforcing Workfront's culture while the company nearly doubles its workforce. Laura is committed to diversity and inclusion and has implemented strategies to reduce bias in the company's 400 annual hires. She partnered with One Refugee to create internships for women who need to reestablish their lives. Through her initiative, retention rates of women have increased, employee engagement has improved, and the company has received multiple awards for their workplace environment. In Laura's free time, she enjoys spending time with her husband and two children. Lena Nilsson is Senior Director of Data Science at Recursion. She has been an instrumental driver in bringing a strategic product mindset to machine learning capabilities. Prior to Recursion, Lena was the Innovation Director at UC Berkeley, where she conceptualized and launched a peer-reviewed journal for open source hardware. Lena holds a PhD in Biomedical Engineering from ETH Zurich in Switzerland. She is an avid hiker and volunteers for the Sierra Club, leading groups of backpackers to Alaska. Linda Llewellyn is the Chief People Officer at Health Catalyst. She has a relentless focus on creating a culture of diversity and inclusion. She provides executive support for the company's women's group, LGBTQA community, and the remote team member experience group. Since implementing new hiring initiatives, she has increased the number of female executive level roles from 29% to 36%. Linda started inclusive listening sessions. Her work is paying off as Health Catalyst has consistently raked between the 95th and 99th percentile in employee satisfaction. Linda participates with Women Tech Council and with the Kids Code Initiative. Marta DeBellis is Chief Marketing Officer at Instructure. She is responsible for all aspects of Instructure's marketing strategy and execution globally and across all brands. Marta is a seasoned marketing leader with more than 26 years of experience in technology. She promotes mentorship programs to connect up-and-coming female leaders to mentors from the executive team. Marta is on the board of Youth Clinic and the Real Life Program for the local refugee community. Marta holds a Bachelor of Science in Electrical and Computer Engineering 
and feels that raising her three wonderful children is one of her greatest personal accomplishments. Maureen Bottoman is Director of Engineering at Pluralsight. She leads and coaches cross-functional teams to create value-added experiences for learners. She launched their engineering internship program and an apprentice program that serves underrepresented groups who come from non-traditional backgrounds like boot camp grads and self-taught developers. She works with Code Ed, Hour of Code, and she launched a chapter of Women Who Code in Utah in partnership with Girl Develop It. Maureen earned an MBA from the University of Utah. She has been to all seven continents and is currently training for a 50K. Tina Larson is Chief Operating Officer at Recursion Pharmaceuticals. She has executive oversight of a high-throughput screening department that conducts 100,000 experiments and generates nearly 20 terabytes of data each week. Tina is a vocal champion for women in STEM. She is an active mentor and strives to create a healthy, positive, diverse, and inclusive work environment. Tina graduated with a bachelor's degree in chemical engineering from Colorado State University and currently serves on the Dean's Advisory Board for the College of Engineering. And the finalists for the 2019 Student Pathway Award. Jessica Jones is currently a junior in the physics program at Utah Valley University. Her current undergraduate research includes the analysis of spectra tissue samples that have been altered to simulate cancerous tumors using a Raman spectrometer she helped build. Jessica co-founded the UVU chapter of Women in Physics to help women across the physical sciences at UVU network, share resources, and gain confidence. Jessica is also a math tutor in the UVU Math Lab and patiently helps students gain greater skills in math. Katie Varela is a junior studying mechanical engineering at Brigham Young University, where she has been working alongside PhD candidates in the school's Materials Innovation Research Lab and has become a leading expert in molecular dynamics simulations. Katie is an active participant in the Women and Engineering and Technology Club. She is the Activities Chair for the local Inspiration for Future Engineers Club, which connects local elementary and middle school children interested in engineering. Katie is a Physics Teaching Assistant. Sarah Stamps is studying Physics with an emphasis in Materials Science at Weber State University and works with WSU's Center for Technology Outreach to connect to young students in the community through programs like the WSU STEM Summer Program, the FIRST Robotics Competition, and Upward Bound. When working with these students, she encourages their love of science and tech and helps them see their place in the industry. This also increases her own confidence and motivates her to continue down her chosen career path. Sarah is also an elementary school literacy tutor and peer tutor for special education students. Serena Aishlima is a junior at the University of Utah studying economics and computer science. She recently completed an internship as a data scientist at NASA's Jet Propulsion Laboratory, where she used Python, Redis, and Linux to create a deduplication tool for NASA's search engine. Serena is a student innovator for the Google Cloud Platform, a computer science teaching assistant, and a campus life mentor. She mentors two high school students and 45 freshmen in computer science. She is passionate about local government and plans to run for Congress in 2024. Congratulations to all the 2019 Women Tech Council Award finalists.